All right, here we come to the Church Avenue parking garage. Sorry for the bubble around me. I just joined in because I had to re-record it. But this is the, f uh, what do I call it? Church Avenue parking garage. We're going to film the elevators here, and then we're going to film the ones on this side, then we'll head to the other side and film the other ones. So, pissing curb elevators. So most of you should have heard of the, this place. These are the modernized ones. Cab view. So we'll wait till we go up. Pretty nice. There's the up there is where the old indicator was. Can't remember what these were. Though. Were they Westinghouse? I can't honestly remember. Someone will have to tell me in the comments. I can't remember. Blue level. And if we get out, you can see the stairs. Oh, I almost fell off. And then this is the parking garage level. And then the other elevator is over there, which we'll go red later. Head back down. Oh, that's right. They have the different buttons up here. I forgot about that. Cool. L. And we'll go ride the other one. Lobby. I always get mixed up with these floors. Let's head up to 4A. Send this one up. Goes into the parking stairs. No parking garages over that way. Slow doors on these things. That's definitely something you could say about these ones. I wish the other ones weren't modernized, but it is what it is, you know. Sorry about that. Spam the door close button. Plus L, so don't have to press it later. Same cab on this one. single elevator which is over there actually not over there i'm not pointing anywhere um this is gonna be a little bit of a quicker video because i gotta get going soon we are gonna be heading to the bucks game which i'm excited of excited for i don't even know what time it is it's 2 two forty. okay we gotta get going soon so i'm gonna schedule this video to go out for later so i don't have two videos at the same time so now let's head into the main parking garage um, which is over that way on the other side. These, this was a definitely, I don't know. I, I, you know, one thing that's hard for me is I definitely don't know which elevators are better. Um, somebody will have to tell me what in the comments. I literally can't remember if, were they Westinghouse or Kone or Dover? I, I can't remember, honestly, did. They modernized them to Tissing Crow, but I can't remember what they were modernized from. So, someone remember they'll have to tell me in the comments because we're gonna head over here. Oh, I went over here. You got little security bays. The parking garage, a little computer in them. All right, now we'll go ride this one. I'm not sure if this one has a different cab. Nope, same cab, but this one's just a single. This one has door hold. Doesn't work, obviously. It has, <laughs> it has the white, the white ones. This one has a different color indicator, does it? I don't know. Oh, I'm just losing. My Sorry, I bumped the mic. Wait, weren't the? Oh, this one's the opposite of the other ones. This one has the blue buttons with the white indicator. The other one had the blue indicator with the white buttons. That makes so much more sense now. 
Same cab on this one, nothing different. Um, blue level, head down to L and we'll end. Watch the button go out as well. Like I said, they're the same cabs. So no, ouch, there's nothing different about them. This one doesn't go to the M level. And then this, we'll check out the MPE on this side. Same thing, just without the window. Right here, so the elevator's gonna leave. There that goes. Now we'll head out and end. Um. So yeah, you can see where they put the elevator and installed the elevator there. Well, thank you guys for watching. Oh, like I said, could you please subscribe so we can get to 5K so I can do another special for you guys. But thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next video and peace out.